The war between Israel and Hamas is a complex conflict with several historical, political, and social causes. One of the main reasons for this conflict is territorial conflict. The conflict over land ownership, particularly in the Palestinian region, is one of the main causes of the conflict. Israel and Hamas claim specific territories, such as Jerusalem and the Gaza Strip, which generate tension and frequent conflict. The construction of Jewish settlements in the Palestinian territories occupied by Israel is a major source of tension. The settlements are considered by Palestinians and the international community to be illegal and an obstacle to peace. Israel considers Hamas a threat to its security due to rocket attacks launched from the Gaza Strip against Israeli cities. Israel says its military actions are a necessary response to protect its citizens. Israel has imposed a blockade on the Gaza Strip controlled by Hamas since 2007, severely limiting the entry of goods and people. This has had a negative impact on the economy and the well-being of Gazans and is a source of resentment against Israel. We must also not forget that political and religious divisions in the region also contribute to the conflict. Hamas is an Islamic group that seeks to establish an Islamic state in the region, while Israel is a Jewish state. These ideological differences constantly increase tensions between the two parties. This war between Israel and the Palestinian Islamic movement triggered by the attack launched by the latter on October 7, has lasted for a month, four weeks during which the fighting caused a very large number of victims. In one month, more deaths than in 15 years of conflict. On the Palestinian side, the Ministry of Health in the Gaza Strip announced that, since the start of the war, 10 to 328 people have been killed in Israeli bombings, the vast majority civilians. Among these deaths, according to the Islamic movement, are 4,237 children and 2,741 women. Nearly 26,000 people were also injured. On the Israeli side, Israeli authorities have reported to date a death toll of more than 1,400, the majority of whom were civilians killed on the day of the Hamas attack. In any case, the figures may vary depending on the source and the period considered. The exact number of casualties and damage can be difficult to determine due to the fluid nature of the conflict and the lack of access to affected areas.